there, there are the real surprises and the, 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 the moments of kind of joy when you recognize that a piece of work is something that you haven't seen before or something was interpreted in a way that you would never have imagined. Um, and for this particular brief, which was the Pantone brief, um, and it was about reimagining your hometown, um, it gave us the opportunity to see hometowns all the way across the world. The more difficult side of it was where you just sort of went, oh, you know, they could have done so much more with it than, than they did, or that didn't take me very far, or I really wouldn't want to go to that place. You know, it hadn't brought it alive. I was expecting to see a lot of identities for people's hometowns, which for us wasn't really enough to answer the brief. A lot of people did some a logo and a colour and then a wayfinding. And we, what we were really looking for was just the idea, especially one that is attached to a philanthropic, altruistic type of message. Those are the really powerful ideas that stand out. If you've got a great brief, just read it. <laughs> read it. And the answer's probably in there. If you just go through it and really understand it. And um, so, yeah, advice is you've been given a brief, answer it. Um, my colour of my hometown, wow, that is a tough question. <laughs> well, I come from London, so you probably say it's multicoloured, so I'm just going to go for pink because it's my favourite colour. <laughs> what colour is my hometown? Um, I'll go for gold.